Greetings, I'm Father John Stratton, and welcome to today's edition of Marking Our Days as Holy. Today, September the 7th, is Labor Day, a national holiday when we celebrate and recognize the dignity of human labor and give thanks for all the protections and benefits that working people have won for our friends and neighbors. But it's not just a national holiday. It is a recognized holy day in the Episcopal Church's liturgical calendar. Today we remember that God is first revealed to us in Scripture as a worker, and that human work is an important part of the original good creation. In the book of Exodus, God sends Moses to Egypt to organize a group of oppressed workers and help them rise up against Pharaoh. The Old Testament prophets demand that workers receive fair wages, and when God comes to us in the flesh, in the person of Jesus Christ, God is incarnate and a carpenter, a worker from Galilee. So today, remember the dignity of human labor, whether that's pouring concrete for a road or mixing formula for a baby and stand in solidarity with the working men and women who make our common life possible, who deserve respect, dignity, safe working conditions, and a living wage. Let us pray. Almighty God, you have so linked our lives one with another that all we do affects for good or ill all other lives. So guide us in the work we do that we may do it not for self alone, but for the common good. And as we seek a proper return for our own labor, make us mindful of the rightful aspirations of other workers and arouse our concern for those who are out of work. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. God bless and happy Labor Day.